In this video, we are going to talk about how to use web URL in Power BI. Recently, one of my clients was asking that we need to embed some of the web URL and they don't want to display the URL in general. However, people can definitely get to know when they are going to redirect to those URLs. So how did I do it? In this video, I'm going to let you know. Hi there, my name is Ajay Kumar and in this video, I'm going to let you know how to use web URLs in Power BI. So over here on my screen, you can see that there is a table and in this table, there are some of the blog names as well as their URLs. If you would like to learn Power BI, then you can follow these blogs as well. All right, the challenge was that once I published this report on my Power BI service and I try to click on these web URLs, I'm not able to click any of these and they were not redirecting. So what to do? Well, whenever you have URL or image URL, first you have to change its category. Well, for that, first you have to select the column in the fields pane and then you have to change the data category. Just click on this and select this web URL. If you are going to use the image URL, you have to select this image URL. So in our case, this is going to be web URL. Now you can see that it has been highlighted and you can use this field as web URL. But the another challenge was that my client, they really didn't want to see these long URLs. What they want to see, they just want to see one URL icon. So how to do that? Well, for that, you can select your table over here. Then you can come under this format pane over here. You can just type over here URL. Once you type URL over here, you would see this URL icon. So you just need to switch it on. Once you do that, then you can see that all the long URL has been gone and they have converted into just an icon. Once you do that, then you can simply publish this report. So let me do it quickly. Now let's go back to our Power BI service and refresh this page. Once I refresh this page, then reports is going to load again. And here I can see that my URL web icons are appearing over here. So just click any of these and it's going to redirect. That means it's working perfectly fine. You can even check others as well. For example, Formo, it's working fine as well. So guys, in this short video, we have just seen that how you can use web URLs in Power BI and how to use URL icons so that you don't need to display the long URLs in your Power BI reports or dashboards. If you have any question and concern, please don't forget to let us know. And also, if you are over here for the very first time, please don't forget to subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon for all the latest Power BI videos and updates. See you in the next video.